downtown Frankenmuth is going all out with a taste of tradition and a touch of something new for the 60th annual Bavarian Festival. It's one of the oldest uh, Bavarian festivals around. It's kept going all these years and we're really excited to keep it going and keep the tradition here in Frankenmuth. All events are being held downtown and Friday night Main Street will close for a first of its kind street party. We're going to put a zip line right down Main Street. It's going to start from Cash Street and come towards Cover Bridge. It's two or three hundred foot long. We're going to have bounce houses, we're going to have classic cars right on Main Street, and then uh, at 10 o'clock we're going to have fireworks. Organizers have been working hard to make sure that this anniversary celebration is more family friendly than ever before. The imagination stations and bounce houses, but Relay for Life will have a giant carnival down behind River Place also. Sunday's parade will honor past princess courts dating back to the early years. We will have the 1964 princess here, so it's, and her, her daughter was also a past princess. For 2018 Princess Court member Abby Angle, Frankenmuth's Bavarian Fest tradition runs deep. My family roots back to the founding fathers um, and today my dad gave me this pin. This is me at my very first ever Bavarian Festival. Um, so I was about one year old in 96. And if previous year's attendance is any indication, it's expected that more than 20,000 people will drop by Little Bavaria over the next few days. <laughs> Surprisingly enough, last year we had a whole bus full, full of people from Arkansas, people from Maine, and actually we had some people from Germany here last year that we met. It was really fun. One thing's for sure, there's guaranteed to be plenty of tons in all weekend long that's dancing. What's the technique here? It's just a skip, hop, and a twirl. All right, we're rocking the maypole in the mooth. Mark Jacobson, ABC 12 News. Dr. Shane! <laughs>